Hello everyone, my name is Jatin Nagi and today we are going to discuss about avocado. Please watch this video till end and if you like it then please share and like this video and subscribe our channel for latest updates. So let's get started. Firstly we are going to discuss what is avocado. Avocado likely originating from south central Mexico which is classified as a member of the flowering plant family Laurasia. The fruit of the plant also called avocado is botanically a large berry containing a single large seed. So this is how avocado looks like you can refer to this image. So let's move further to types of avocado. These are some varieties. First is chocket which is large oval mild taste then reed which is large round nutty flavor then maluma which is large oval nutty taste then gwen which is small pear shaped nutty flavor then has which is medium oval superior rich taste then lula which is large pear shaped slightly sweet then pink keratin which is large elongated rich nutty flavor then bacon which is medium oval light creamy flesh then cleopatra which is medium pear shaped rich uh, creamy flesh then brogdon which is medium pear shaped rich nutty flavor then furet which is medium pear shaped rich creamy flesh then etinga which is medium pear shaped mild taste then zutano medium pear shaped mild taste further monroe which is very large club shaped mild taste then sharewell which is medium pear shaped mild taste so this is all about types of avocados now we are moving further to health benefits of avocado improving digestion is the first main health benefit then decreasing risk of depression then protection against cancer then avocado is incredibly nutritious then they contain more potassium than bananas this is important then avocado is loaded with heart healthy monounsaturated fatty acids then avocados are loaded with fiber then eating avocado can lower cholesterol and triglyceride levels then people who eat avocado tend to be healthier. So this is all about the health benefits. Now we are moving further to post harvest management of avocado. The temperature is lower to slow the metabolism of the fruit so that it can be stored. This slows ethylene synthesis and its effect. It is therefore sought to bring the fruits to best temperature for storage as rapidly as possible after harvesting. Ideally is less than 6 hours. Then the duration of cooling depends on the initial and final temperature of the fruit and on the ambient air conditions, temperature, wind velocity and relative humidity. The time necessary varies from 8 to 10 hours. It is important to halt the cooling phase 2 degrees Celsius before the final temperature desired to be sure not to reach temperatures that are too low and that might damage the produce. So this is all about post harvest management. So let's move further. To our last slide that is reference i have collected all the information from these websites you can go to these websites and find all the information so this is all about our today's video i hope you have learned something from this video please like and share this video and subscribe our channel thanks for watching